guys, Tommy here. Welcome back to another video. Uh, today we'll, I'm basically doing a guide, I guess, on Tyrannum. But uh, yeah, I just wanted to just talk about it because like a lot of people are just spawning inside the map, like around where other friends are, and that's okay. You, you play how you want, but um, so I am gonna make basically a little guide about. Basically, why this place is the best spot for growing tarantulas. Uh, I'll go over a few things, but the main part is that there's nobody here. It's easy to grow peacefully if there's nothing attacking you. And so that's the beauty of this place. There's literally nobody here. And, because you're a flying creature, you can just stay away from people on the ground and food and water are not an issue i've been here for basically i don't know 10 20 minutes and i have not lost much of my hunger i've just been flying around this bay but what really makes it special is that like it's just a really good area in general for practicing flying there's not a lot of trees over there and like down here there's only palm trees so like i mean it's easier to avoid you, you can get practice while flying here and um i'm pretty sure if you're like bad with the fishing aspect you can practice on the uh ocean because um i mean you can still just hold down the uh the catch button but like what the Grow there, so we need. And since Tyrannon grows so fast, you can be out of here. So I'm already at 25%, and I am almost at full food and water 74%, 71%, and 61%. I have not lost most of my money in food. I gotta get this flying thing down. But, um, basically what I'm trying to say is that you can just practice here. This is the ideal spot for Tyrannon. And, plus, when you're an adult Tyrannon and nesting gets in, this spot would be... It wouldn't be the most ideal, I wouldn't say that. But it would be pretty ideal, since there's not gonna be a lot of people here. You're a flying creature, so you can basically go from the other map, from one side of the map to the other. And plus, food and water are not that much of an issue. You can just go catch fish. And by the time the baby is 25% or up, they're already going to be off to get water. There, up into the air. Since I'm older, I'm going to leave this area, just so I don't end up screwing myself over. But, um, yeah, that place is basically just a, um, a great place to, oh, crap, crap, and a tree. But, uh, anyways, thank you all for watching. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Bye-bye.